Welcome. Uh, my name is Andrew. I'm the Assistant Director of Employer Relations with the Pierce College Center for Career and Professional Development. Very long title. Um, so I'm here with Trish from the Addison Group. Um, the Addison Group has a Philadelphia branch, but is headquartered in Chicago, and they have offices all across the country. So Trish is going to talk to us a little bit about the Addison Group um, and what what their areas are, uh, focus areas. Um, they work with business, accounting, financial operations, HR, IT, healthcare. Uh, they work with healthcare administration, billing and coding, and more. So take it away, Trish. Absolutely. Well, thank you for having me. Um, it's been a pleasure getting to know you and learning more about Pierce College. Um, the Addison Group, we're right here in Philadelphia, but we have 29, we're present in 29 cities across um, the U.S. Um, as you mentioned, we are in six different verticals providing talent-based solutions for our clients and our candidates. Um, IT, finance and accounting, healthcare, which is my division, human resources, administration, and digital marketing. So we really pride ourselves in working directly with candidates to make sure they find that perfect fit um, and have that career growth as well with our clients. Excellent. Um, can you walk us through a typical process and how that works and how, how someone would apply? Absolutely. So we partner with a, a different organizations specific to healthcare, nonprofits, FQHC, which is federally qualified health centers and major health systems as well. Um, I'm specific to Pennsylvania, New Jersey, Delaware, and New York. Um, while we're going through the process, we have a large pool of candidates and we have our jobs listed on our website. And let's just start with when the candidate applies. We make sure that the candidate's ex expertise matches what we're looking for. We reach out, we set up a phone screen to start, really get to know the candidate, understanding what the candidate is looking for in their next career move. Uh, we want to make sure that it's a happy marriage between the client and the candidate. Um, after we have that initial conversation, we do set up a virtual or an in-person um, meeting between the recruiter and the candidate to dive in more into the, the experience and the skill set to make sure it is that match that we're looking for for both parties. Once we go through that, we do work with the candidate, whether it's helping with their resume, making it polished, prepping them for their interview, which is either virtual or face-to-face. -face. And then before or after that interview, we always connect with the candidate and really try to understand how did the interview go? What did you think? Um, and of course we get the feedback from the client. One thing that we do pride ourselves is that we make sure that we are with the candidate every step of the way along with the client as well. Excellent. So you're working with multiple clients throughout the whole region. Are you able to um, br briefly describe some examples of the types of titles or roles that you're working on, or even um, if we're able to mention any of those clients by name or describe your clients? Absolutely. Um, I won't name any uh, clients, but I think we all know the big uh, health systems right here in Philadelphia. Um, that's pretty, pretty obvious here. So we are working with them, Jefferson, Penn, um, you name it. But what we're looking for um, are front end and back end when it comes to healthcare. So that could be front desk, uh, patient access, and then going to the back end, we're working with billers and coders and insurance verifiers. And um, as that's specific to the healthcare group, where um, within my office, we have an HR and admin team and a finance and accounting team, and they are working roles like controllers, AP specialists, AR specialists, um, and name a few for HR. You have an HR generalist, an HR admin, even a recruiter sometimes. We help our clients with that as well, uh, but really, or an admin assistant. So those are a few types of roles that come right out of this Philadelphia office. Excellent. And with, with the roles that you work on, um, does it seem like most of them are hybrid or in-person or virtual or a little bit of everything? Yeah, you know, we're seeing a little bit of both right now. It's dependent on the role, more of those front end positions, you're, you're in person, right? But some of those uh, back end positions like billers and coders, they seem to be a little bit more remote or hybrid depending on the, the client. 
but we are we do see a general mix. So that's what is really helpful when candidates come to Addison, even if they don't see a specific job, because we can tailor our search with them as well if they're looking for that on-site, remote, or hybrid opportunity. Excellent. So are are companies still interviewing in person or should should candidates be prepared for a virtual round one? Um, you know, do do, yeah. do your clients still do phone screens? What, what's the process like as a so, candidate? Great question. For our process, we handle the phone screen. And in addition to the phone screen, we do that virtual or in person, depending on the, the circumstance. And we do that reference check as well, working with the candidates to get some, you know, previous employers to, you know, give a good word about their experience with them. Um, but when it comes to the client, it is a it is a preference. But as Addison, our, our way, we really like to kind of suggest that in person because that's the best way you can really get to know somebody, and it's the best way for a candidate to prove, you know, their their mannerisms and their professionalism and their ability to have those face-to-face -face conversations. Excellent. Um, so at Pierce College, we we have a lot of non-traditional students. Mm -hmm. um, are you able to give any kind of tips or pointers for non-traditional recent graduates or job seekers? In other words, recent grads who, who are older than the, the traditional, you know, early 20s. Yeah. Well, I think what's really important is to be open minded when it comes to the job search, getting your foot into a door into the door of a, a strong health system or a strong client is really a pathway to continue and progress in your career. I think it's also important to stress those soft skills and even life personal and professional experiences into your interview discussions. Excellent. Um, so do you have any examples of uh, maybe some do's and don'ts, uh, things not to say in an interview yeah, or uh, I sure what do. you should try to highlight? <laughs> Absolutely. Um, you know, when it comes to compensation, when you're going to your first interview with, um, let's say we set you up with the client, the first word out of your mouth doesn't want to be about compensation. Um, and what's nice about working with Addison or a recruiter, we're already, you know, getting that over with up front. We know the range that you're looking for. We know the client's uh, pay scale. And then you're really kind of getting that, taking that part away from the conversation. But I have seen it happen and it's, it puts a bad taste in the, the interviewer's, you know, mind a little bit. Um, one other tip is if somebody asks you if you have any questions, you go to an interview with no questions to ask, that shows that you're unprepared or you're not interested in learning more than what the interview provided. So I'd say those two things are pretty heavy when it comes to being prepared for an interview. That's that's uh, that's really good advice. Thank you for that. Yeah. Um, anything else you would add about the kind of roles that your office works on or the kind of roles that you're hiring for right now or roles that typically tend, tend to be ongoing no matter what year or what time of the year? Yeah. So... One thing I want to mention, I don't think I did already, is that we do two different types, well, three different types of um, hiring. We do contract to hire, project work, or direct placement. Um, a lot of my team is that contract to hire. It's really the, the client's way of the try before you buy model. Um, and it's looking to, it's almost like a working interview, which I think is a great model for both the candidate and the client. You get to get a taste of the job and the uh, and you know the environment and the culture, but those are the three uh, like pillars of how we hire here with Addison. Um, and as far as roles, we are always looking for billers. We are always looking for front desk associates, um, insurance verification on the healthcare side, and from the HR side, like I said, admin assistants. They also do front desk. They're also looking for HR generalists. Um, payroll coordinators, and then lastly, with the finance piece, um, you have those payroll specialists and AP, AR, billing specialists, staff accountants, financial analysts, even all the way up to a controller. That covers a wide range. That, that, it sure uh, does. But what's, what's, great, what's great about Addison is my team knows exactly what to look for when it comes to healthcare. We're very specialized. And same with the HR admin team and then same with the finance team. So we like to know exactly what we're looking for and how we're going to do it and how we're going to find that perfect marriage between the client and the candidate. 
Excellent. And so if I'm an a applicant or a candidate, how, how do I find you? How do I apply? How do I see what, what I should send my info? Where I should send Easy. Addisongroup.com. There's a uh, tab that says get hired and you get to see all the open positions, remote, hybrid in the area. Um, again, we're specific to PA, New Jersey, Delaware, New York. But again, we have offices across um, the U.S. If you have family or friends that are looking for jobs, Addison's, Ad, Addison has a presence. Excellent. Well, thank you so much for, for yeah. spending the time and, and for answering those questions. Absolutely. And, um, pleasure. I appreciate it. All right. Thanks a lot. All right. Thank you. Thank you.